There it is, the new banana bloom. These bananas, we were they were given to us. We had two to start with. And the person that gave us the bananas doesn't remember what the name of them were, but it looks like they got pretty decent rack. They're nice, medium-sized bananas. Um, so we'll see how they taste, but they also provide a shade. And then here's the cassava that is falling over. We are going to um, harvest the branches, try to propagate it a little bit. It's beautiful though. Put it in a greenhouse for the uh, winter. Look over here. All right, there's my berry tree. And I'll show you guys these things. These are little daisies, but seal seeds, they stick to your clothes. It's almost like they're like the Mexican sunflower seeds. So let me putting everything down. And as you can tell, oh, there's my clippers. I found them. Ha ha. Nice. So this is our strawberry tree or Jamaican tree. And as you can tell, they're just, the berries start out green and when they're ready to be picked, I just got to be careful because I do have a lynx spider. I think he's on the other side though. But when they're ready to be picked, they turn red. Uh, this one's a bad example. Looks like the bugs got to that one. Yeah. And I do leave because I get squirrels and birds. So the ones up top, I'm not worried about, but here's one. Oh, it stinks being short. <sighs> but that's what they look like. And it's like a burst of cotton candy in your mouth. It's sweet. Love it. Now, I don't like this, the skin. So, I just take it and toss it on the ground. But, I'm going to do some picking. And some cutting back of these... Um, these daisy weeds because like I said I was in here the other day and these seeds they're like Mexican sunflower seeds you can see them they stick to you bad all in the clothes they're kind of pokey so not too worried about the seeds fall in because this year we're going to be uh, ripping this whole area up. Um, actually, this winter we're going to be doing... Hey, Mr. Butterfly. Oh, and I want to show you guys this. All right. So this was my old flop pen. Um, one of the cotton... Oh, I really got to mow in here. One cotton plant grew with no problems and then I have all this gorgeous red sorrel I need to probably pick some of these and then the flowers bloom in the morning look at that ain't that beautiful but I make I dehydrate these and I make Donald's red sorrel tea that he drinks at work. Oh, this one's a big one. And as you can tell, I have two whole rows, so I am going to get a lot this year. 
So I'm thinking about uh, making some jam with these. Um, I haven't quite decided yet, so we will see. But yeah, that's my red sorrel area. I just found a grasshopper exoskeleton. That's pretty crazy. Link spider nest. Um, she had this huge egg sac. Link spiders are harmless. They are, um, if you do get bit by them, it's like a, a mosquito type bite. Oop. Oh, there she is. There's the, there she is. All right, there she is with the egg sac. I don't know how close she'll let me get her. And then they wrap the sack in the leaves. Um, and then we'll have babies. <laughs> I don't mind spiders as long as they are outside. But don't let them come in my house. Mm -mm, don't put up with it. Okay. It's only about 8.30 in the morning. And just 15 minutes out here in this humidity. Whew. So, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to pick a few berries for Donald's lunches. So, see you guys in a little bit. Hey guys, if you like that video, hit that like button, remember that bell, and subscribe. And if you want to see any of the other videos, check out everything over here.